guys, it's me back again on this channel and as you can see from the title, this video is about my top 100 K-pop songs of 2019, only music videos included, because there are so many songs and I'm very much a multi-fandom, I listen to a lot of artists, not just groups, a lot of solo artists as well, a lot of Korean R&B, which I also included in this, maybe just to give you a small explanation why I had to narrow it down to a specific thing and I chose music videos. Um, I think it's also easier to display music videos in such a video. Yeah, let's go to some criteria before we get started with the top 100 list. Um, I don't want to make this section too long. If you don't want to watch this uh, and you just want to see my top 100 songs, then you can skip ahead. The main criteria were in three groups. It was one, uh, music video criteria, uh, including locations, story, quality, humor, camera work, effects and other innovative elements, like just something that I have never seen before. The second uh, section was the chorus. The criteria are catchiness, a good drop into the chorus or a good transition, and just uh, variations throughout the song. What I mean by that is just that um, the second or the third chorus is very different from the first one, so that it kind of progresses. The third section is my overall song enjoyment, and uh, yeah, this section is the most subjective of the three. It includes the criteria of just the choreo, at least from what I can see in the music video. Just the single parts, part one, two, three. And then also the rap parts, one, two, three, however many there are. The visuals in general, like how they look, the outfits and the charisma. Then the overall just feeling and enjoyment I get from the song, like that can be everything included in there. Like this is very, very subjective. I might have like a specific memory I um, connect to the song um, because of the lyrics, but maybe because of the moment of time when the song came out or how many times I listened to or what happened when I listened to the song, stuff like that, right? And last but not least, the lyrics, of course. So the lyrics are very important to me as well. So yeah, these were the three main groups. There are a few exceptions, of course, that I, or in terms of songs I don't include in this. There's a lot of subjective opinion in here, in this video, and if you don't like my opinion, that's totally fine. You can tell me what's your, like, top 10 or top 50 or top 100, however much you like, songs of the year. Uh, what songs maybe I have not included in this list that you uh, would have wanted to see. Maybe it's even songs I don't know yet and I have to check out first and can react to. <laughs> I'm 